Anzac, a victim of illegal hunting, was confiscated by the Congolese authorities from a poacher. Anzac was then transported to the city of Brazzaville before being sent to the Jankul Institute Chapunga Sanctuary for care. When she arrived, Anzac weighed just 2.6 kilograms and the veterinary team discovered she was suffering from an intestinal parasite infection which they promptly treated. In the morning, Anzac loves to make grass angels. She lies on her back, flapping her arms, enjoying the feel of the dew-covered ground. Anzac now enjoys a second chance thanks to the Jangul Institute. She spends each day with two other young infants, tiny JJ, happy and playful. And Zola, curious though still liking to stay close to mum. JGI caregiver Antoinette is now one of Anzac's new mothers. Her years of experience and gentle nature will ensure these small babies feel safe and protected. Solar and Anzac observe all the sounds and movements around them. Each day is an adventure full of mysteries to solve. The footsteps of some passing caregivers frighten them and they quickly retreat to the security of Antoinette. The morning is cool and damp, nothing like a bottle of warm milk to fill the bellies of Anzac and her two small friends. Another sound disturbs the trio. This time, it's Lemba and her two friends who are on their way to the forest. They travel in a wheelbarrow, already too large to be carried by their caregiver. And they enjoy the ride along the bumpy road there. It's already late and everybody is tired. Tomorrow will be another day full of new adventures at Chipunga. It's time for a final bottle of milk and a good night's sleep.